decided to do another top 5 video today. Totally not because I ran out of video ideas. I mean, come on now, guys. Anyways, today we're going to be looking at the top 5 LEGO Ninjago sets of all time. Some of these sets are ones that I actually own and some are not. So without further ado, let's get straight into this list. At number 5, the Garmatron. I really adored this set back when it first came out, mainly for its awesome look and affordable price. It came with two exclusive figures, General Kozu, my first ever four-armed figure, and Zane. And I feel that it's one of the coolest Ninjago sets ever released. At number 4, the Ninja DBX. I really like this set. It had a really sleek design to it, and the minifigure selection was great. Although, I felt like LEGO should have included one more ninja in the set, it was a solid set and deserves the number 4 spot. At number 3 is the Ultrasonic Raider. I really admired the bold design that LEGO chose for this set, it was something unique that Ninjago has never seen before. Additionally, it also had an awesome set of minifigures, including all 4 ninja and Pythor. At the number 2 spot, Attack of the Moral Dragon. I'm very fond of this set, probably because it looks like the best LEGO dragon I've ever seen. I love the printed wings on the dragon, and the minifigures in this set just complement the dragon perfectly. Plus, it's the cheapest way to get Possessed Lloyd, which in my opinion looks like one of the coolest Ninjago villains. And finally, at the number one spot, the Temple of Air Jitsu. Now, this is a set that I don't actually own, partially because of how expensive it is. But I really like this set, especially the little details that they included in the architectural design of the building. Included all of the ninja along with some exclusive minifigures, such as the Postman and Misako that we've never ever seen before. Overall, it's a set worthy of the number one spot. 